guys, today we're gonna have our very first look at the Labrador Retriever DLC. Expansive Worlds just finished their live stream and they look completely amazing. We're also going to hear from Jaxie about when the next great one is set to release. EW is definitely doing things differently this time around. So we're actually going to get to see Jaxie shoot a few birds and actually watch the retriever go right into the water, swim and retrieve it. So these dogs will pick up all class one species. I believe Jaxie said they can pick up things as big as a caper cali or a murder chicken. So I'm not sure if they can pick up turkeys or not. I'm not sure. Now, some of the audio I'm just going to talk on top of because the stream did have some audio difficulties, but it did get fixed towards the end of the stream. So we will get to see some parts with the audio, but I am getting early access to this new DLC very, very soon. And that is very exciting. So this is what we know. This DLC comes out on November 28th as a sim ship on all three platforms. So that is awesome. So with the new Labrador Retrievers, there will be seven different fur coats that you can choose from. You can only work with one dog at a time. So you can't take your Bloodhound out with your Retriever. You can take one or the other. Now, when you first get it, it will be at the very base level and we will have to level it up just like we did with the Bloodhounds and pick the traits we want for this particular lab but of course we can have multiple dogs and the very first one when you buy the DLC will be free and I believe after that they are 45,000 in-game dollars. I just want to show you guys the retriever retrieving these birds from the water. It the is so cool to you see. How well you placed your shot. Holy! Can I get zero please? Well we got one down. Love to get you in the water. <laughs> Go on, buddy. Do your thing. Do your thing. It didn't quite make the water. But uh, there it is, man. Does that not look great? He's not shy. There's no obstacle to get in his way. <laughs> I love it. I freaking love it. Oh, my God. Uh, big shout out to our devs. Uh, there was extra love and time that went into this one with the new dog animations. There it is. So that was pretty cool, right? I am very excited to use these and I really do think this is going to encourage a lot of people to do a lot more waterfowl hunting. This changes waterfowl hunting. Try hold okay, maybe it is. One Just more. Don't do it for too long. It's in the water. This is why. Go on, buddy. Go on, buddy. Yeah, he did. And we do have a price. It is going to be $5.99 US dollars. Now, I think a lot of work went into this more than we realized. And I think that's indicative of the price. And honestly, EW really doesn't charge a lot for their DLCs. If you compare them to other games, they really don't. I have seen it all. I did not ever think that even if we got a retriever, that we would ever have this functionality right here. I do believe you're good to about 100 meters or more. It might even go up to 150. I'm not 100% positive on that. Yes, you're such a good boy. <laughs> so we will no longer have to wait for those really annoying little floaters. We will have these beautiful dogs to retrieve them for us. And they have done a completely amazing job. So now Jaxi is going to show us some of the different fur types and they look completely amazing. Guys, let me know in the comments which your favorite is and what you think of the new Labrador Retrievers. Let's go ahead and bring them out. Let's just get a bunch of dogs. Who else wants a dog? Come on now. Who wants a dog? This one's going to be on the black. We're going to set them all up here. We'll bring them all out one at a time. And uh, did I just go? We, we have the chocolate out, so we'll go with the fox red. Absolutely. This one's the charcoal. Champagne. The silver. Slide into another setup. Oh, that is pretty. 
Now, the other interesting thing that was said at the EW live stream this morning that you're probably not going to be super excited about is that we are not getting a new great one this year. The next great one is going to be out in 2024. We don't know what month. Jaxie actually said at the last EW stream that there were going to be multiple DLCs coming out in the next couple of months. Now, great ones aren't a DLC. They just add them to the game, usually with the new map. So maybe the next great one is going to come with the new map. I'm hoping it's not going to be all the way in June, that maybe we'll see it in February or March. They said they'll let us know as soon as they know. They don't actually know when it is going to be out, but they are putting more time and energy into this next new map, and I think it's going to be something pretty great. Now, Jaxie's actually going to show us the leveling up and the traits of the new Labrador Retrievers. Let's have a look. Oh, I did quickly touch on these unfortunately there's not a lot i can give you here but we can give you some descriptions you can see at the level five we've got loving you have an even more loving relationship with your dog which increases its overall bond or of course you have the strong trait uh the dog is less burdened by carrying harvests level 10 you're going to find the sixth sense your dog has a higher chance of sensing when an animal is about to be spooked and your dog is able to fetch arrows that it can reach only works with the recycle perk your dog will help like a wolf on command your dog will run further away in a search something to retrieve sharp your dog is naturally more willing to work and has increased focus Control if the idle, or sorry, if idle, your dog will go into the heel position when you fire your weapon. Close, your dog has a higher chance of staying close to you. The web pause is kind of cool. Of course, if you get to level 30, you've got your dog has a chance to ward off the predator attacks. And of course, the retriever, your dog retrieves at longer distances and is less burdened by carrying harvest. So there you have it. Those are all the traits for the labs. What I like to do is usually level one up with one set of traits and then buy another dog and level them up with the opposite traits and just see how differently they work in comparison with each other. And that has been a really fun thing for me to do. So I think I'm going to do that again. And I'm very excited to get my hands on this new DLC. And it looks like they did a completely amazing job on it. So on Friday, November the 24th, that is the day when all of the EW creators will be allowed to release content on the new Labrador Retrievers. So you guys can look forward to that. Let me know in the comments what you think, guys. And thank you so much for watching.